Hey everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create this beautiful animation in a very simple steps. First, drag and drop your logo, then add one text layer and change it to sign in. And remember, this is a heading. It always should be bold or medium since it's covering for the entire container. Then add one rectangle for the input box. Just adjust the height to 85 pixel and width to 450 pixel and radius to 10 and pick the border color. Then add one text layer and change it to email ID. Since it's an input, so I'm changing to regular. Then group together. Then use the repeated grid and group it three more times. And simply ungroup it and change the text field to password then change the text into center and change the color because of this is CTA since this is CTA we should remember it should be a medium or bold always Then duplicate the text layer and add few more necessary content such as password and create a new account like that. Then duplicate the primary CTA and change the color for the secondary button then we are gonna add forgot password for the icon for hide and show the text for easy access, I'm going to create this two in a component. Then I'm creating a new state and simply I'm selecting that new state icon and reducing the opacity to zero. So you could switch between the states. Then simply add into the password field. Now we're gonna create this email and password for the real animation. In order to do that, we need to duplicate each of them in one more time. I'm gonna change this to field state like sample at gmail.com. Then I'm adding one rectangle top of it. Then I'm selecting both of them and I'm masking it. Then simply I'm reducing that mask width layer to zero so I'm gonna do same way for the password so now the password field has a two things one is hide and show so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna create two different text field one for the hide and password and one for visible password so I'm gonna use the same tricks adding one layer top of it 
and then hiding that in a visible area now we can duplicate the artboard and select the email text and reduce the opacity to zero then select the mask layer and increase the width so my text is getting visible now then simply add the prototype tab auto animate is in out 0.6 second now check the prototype it's working then simply add the break line so it look like typing then duplicate the second artboard and do the same process select the text and select the opacity 0 and select the mask text and increase the width then the prototype now check whether it's working then the same way we can do it in a hide and show now we can toggle between the state then the prototype now check whether it's working then i thought of adding one more detail to my design so i decided to add one loader animation for the cta so the user get a proper indication for what things are happening so i'm adding lotte animation here you can download anything you wanted i'm choosing the simple indicator then i'm adding one rectangle to my cta then drop your lotte into that shape then reduce the opacity to 0 then duplicate the same artboard and here you can reduce the sign in opacity to 0 then add lotte uh, opacity to 100 and don't forget to play automatically then simply prototype the sign in button Then check it. Then I thought of adding one success page, so I'm duplicating the same onboard. Then I'm adding a rectangle. And adding the blur. then i'm adding the text successful then adding one tick icon and prototyping into time delay that's it guys